I really am strongly against identity crisis. I really feel that hegemony has dominated even the body. I believe that because of our Eurocentric training, we have been trained in European consciousness for so long in many, in many of our areas. Yet against all that, we as Jamaicans are rich with culture, rich with information. And so I believe that for me, cultural identity, not only Jamaican, but sometimes related to the Caribbean, is important. And I have found a way over years to develop a technique called Lantec, which is now examinable at Cape level. It's, and a technique means a, 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 a movement structure specific to a training procedure. Because ballet is ballet, Graham is Graham, all these various techniques named after their creators are specific movements that are created for a, a way of training the body. So I worked hard to develop Lantec as a training procedure that is def def definitely not dominated by the hegemony. But then you, have you can have a double hegemony. You can become so Caribbean conscious, you, you forget that the Caribbean is everything. Jamaica is out of many one people. And when the Africans came off the ship, the boat, Europeans came off them, and then some Indians came. And, they, and they're all part of our culture. So to create a non-hegemonic technique, you have to give respect to all those cultures. La Cadco, a Carimar dance company, because in my thesis, my PhD thesis, I keep telling people we are a Carimar. That means a modern dance company dominated by Caribbean information. We're not a normal everyday dance company. We're not a European modern dance company. We are a modern contemporary company with dancers who are trained in with the same kind of lines and body language, but as in a synthesis with our Caribbean information dominating it. So when the curtain opens, you mustn't be confused where we're from. The, you, you can't have five dance companies on stage. One from America, one from London, one from Jamaica, one from India, and one from China. And when I go on the stage, you don't know where I come from. My language, my body language must be distinctly who I am, yet you must see that I am highly trained.
love. I remember the day I went to US Embassy and the man told me I can't get no visa. And I remember my fire could sell cross off the man and ask him if it's because he do have no wife. True, true, true. And I said to the man, I want a visa. And the man gave me two weeks and write it in red and put two cross cross. So I went to America and then I reached, I, I get a, a frightening experience. I had a father who was totally against that. So I'm living in Queens and my father burn up all my leotard and tights and tell me say I must never go to a dance class. And here am I now, 20 something years old and can never go to a dance class. And my father didn't know I started a dance company on the campus. Please like, subscribe, click the bell for notifications and share.